Well, it's not the heading today here is Doppler effect in light. To light sound, I told you have so the relation motion between source of sound and observer. Then frequency of sound heard by observer is different from the uh, real or actual frequency of source of sound. Similarly, in light. Whenever there is relative motion, relative motion between source of light, source of light. and observer then frequency frequency of light observed by observer is different from the real frequency of light. This is Doppler effect in light. Like sound. When distance between the source of light and observer observer is decreasing Then observed frequency is found higher than is found higher than the real frequency as we know light has seven color violet to red we pure violet color has high frequency then and red has lowest frequency Wavelength by violet has the smallest wavelength, 4000 Armstrong, red has longest wavelength. Hmm. So, the color of light is found shifted. Towards violet violet color. 
When distance between the observer and light source, if distance between the source of light and observer decrease increases then frequency And hence the color of light color of light is found shifted towards the end. Hence, color of light is found shifted towards rare color. This shift is called red shift. Dear student, you may be misguided that this is not in your syllabus. I have seen questions in uh, need exam and other exam also based on Doppler effect using light. So please uh, try to learn something actually when we are learner we think that we should learn the least. No, we have to learn maximum. Only then we can succeed in life. Now this red ship and oil exit. When people do not know what is this, they get confused. So I told you when distance between the source and observer decreases, frequency found higher than actual when distance increases. In light, that change in frequency or wavelength is found to depend on who moves. Since the speed of light is a universal constant, universal constant. This fact was told by Einstein that the speed of light is maximum, no object can travel the speed of light. Uh, only light can travel. Means photon 
पार्टिकल कैन है स्पीड ऑफ लाइट यूनिवर्सल कॉन्स्टेंट एंड हैज लार्ज वैल्यू यू नो सी पर टू थ्री इंटू टेन टू पावर एट मीटर पर सेकेंड सो वैलोसिटी ऑफ सोर्स और ऑब्जर्वर और ऑब्जर्वर डज नॉट मेक डज नॉट मेक एनी चेंज इन द वेलोस्टी ऑफ लाइट वेलोस्टी ऑफ लाइट विद विद रेस्पेक्ट टू सोर्स और ऑब्जर्वर यू मे बी थिंकिंग वाट आई एम टेलिंग इन साउंड इफ सोर्स मूव्स अलोंग द डायरेक्शन ऑफ साउंड देन स्पीड ऑफ साउंड विद सोर्स वाज सी माइनस बी एस and same thing regarding the observer but in case of light the speed of sound light sorry the speed of light does not change with the uh, uh, with the speed of source and observer it only depends na so so doppler effect in light डोपलस इफेक्ट इन लाइट डिपेंड्स ओनली रिलेटिव मोशन हु मूव्स the source or observer does not matter does not matter sound mein tha ke agar source chalta hai towards observer ek frequency i gave the example ke when source of light has to move towards the of the stage of observer then to to get the change of frequency twice to make the frequency twice source was c by 2 if observer move then that has to move with the speed c but here this is not matter because i have been i still told that the speed of light is maximum and all electromagnetic wave traveling vacuum with the same speed <coughs> uh, there was question once ke through photons are traveling in a given direction dono ki speed c hai to what is the normal if one photon is second photon to what is the speed of photon to with respect to one to so that is c their relative nice uh, relativity is something different from the uh, classical uh, relativity now we will obtain the expression for change of frequency and change of wavelength uh if new be the real frequency real frequency uh of light source and v v the relative velocity between source and observer
if distance between the two is decreasing then from theory of relativity of the frequency is given by new base equal to new under root 1 plus v upon c upon 1 minus v upon c v is the relative velocity c is the speed of light v is the relative velocity relative velocity c is speed of light or nu des is equal to nu into 1 plus v s v upon c to the power half or 1 minus v upon c to the power minus half i think you you have got it what i have written power root means power half actually you know agar humne root x likha to iska matlab power half अब नीचे था ऊपर ये तो माइनस हो गया नाउ आई हैव टोल्ड मेनी टाइम्स इफ एक्स मच लेस देन वन देन वन प्लस एक्स की पावर एन इज इक्वल टू वन प्लस एन एक्स तो यूनिट दैट बाय नोमल एक्सटेंशन वी कैन राइट हियर न्यू डेस इक्वल टू न्यू इनटू वन प्लस हाफ वी ए फोन सी और इन टू वन माइनस माइनस हाफ इन टू बी बाई सी इट मीन इट इज न्यू इन टू वन प्लस वी बाई टू सी इन टू वन प्लस वी अपॉन टू सी इफ वी मल्टीप्लाई दीज टूगेदर न्यू वन वन या वन प्लस v upon 2c this into this v upon 2c plus v square upon 2c square this term is negligible small c very large square become very large so neglecting neglect the term v square upon 2c square we get New base equal to new into one plus this plus this b by c, or it is new base equal to new minus plus new into b upon c, and therefore new base minus new is equal to new into b upon c, or new base minus new. Upon you equal to v upon c. Here v may be the velocity of light, source or velocity of source or rel this relative velocity between the two. So delta nu, delta nu equal to nu, delta nu to nu dash equal to v upon c. So frequency if Distance increasing, then it is plus. Okay. Now, if you try to find the change change in wavelength, so from here, uh, again, I told you here, new dash equal to new into uh, one plus v. v upon c 
So new dash is equal to one upon lambda dash. C upon lambda dash. C upon lambda into one plus V upon C. C dash cancel. So we need here actually we try to find out lambda dash minus lambda. So a mathematical trick here is that if we have lambda dash equal to lambda, so it will be 1 plus b upon c to the power minus 1. Ulta is gone. We have 1 upon lambda into 1 plus b by c. If we have ulta, so lambda is gone, but minus. Again, from binomial theorem, it will be 1 minus b upon c. Power minus 1 here. This please remember this thing. Power whatsoever it is negative positive comes here. Multiply. Or lambda dash equal to lambda minus lambda b upon c. Or lambda dash minus lambda upon lambda minus b upon c. This minus sign indicate here that at distance degree wavelength decreases. Agar distance bad raha hai, bad raha hai to wavelength decrease hoga. Frequency higher hogi, wavelength chota hoga. Na bhai, chota wavelength high frequency violent color ke liye hoti hai. Similarly, if distance between the uh, uh, increasing so then new dash if distance between the source and observer increasing then new dash equal to new into 1 <coughs> uh, minus v upon c upon 1 plus v upon c and from this you will get delta nu upon nu minus v upon c this indicates that when distance increasing, frequency decreases or delta lambda upon lambda will be V upon C. V upon C means wavelength is increasing when distance increases. So this was all about Doppler effect. Actually Doppler effect we use in the radar system. Radar, we follow radar. Radar. Radio, radio detection, radio detection and ranging. Radio, it means radio detection. Detection and ranging. Radar is used for navigation of aeroplanes and we can use radar in warfare to know the uh, activity of aeroplanes uh, in the space. Radar use microwave which are electromagnetic wave of sorted wavelength, radio wave, sorted I have told you red microwave. Because they can travel long distance straight without diffraction. I hope you will enjoy it. Please, but learn this Doppler that you like also. In class 11, teacher say this is out of syllabus. Before two years, there was a question in PMT exam on Doppler. It is Doppler, Doppler effect. Why do you go light or sound? We must know everything. Thank you. Please. Share the video. I have completed the whole syllabus. So please, uh, you may give your message what to do further. Do you want more question chapter wise or not? Please uh, tell me your difficulties. See you uh, in numericals again here. Thank you.